Hey everybody, this is Marco, and I'm watching Jack Reacher Never Go Back. You think you're above the law, but I'm not the law. So you should start running, because I'm going to start hunting. And when I find you, I'm going to kill you all. So, um, I'm very disappointed in this one. Um, I'm here at the Discount Movie Theater, and when this comes out on Redbox or DVD, I advise you to skip it. Um, it is not very entertaining at all. Um, it's one that you could probably miss and forget about. Um, for one, the acting is very low level, low level stuff. Um, I mean, the Born Legacy, the one with Jeremy Renner, kind of reminds me of this one, but that was even better. Uh, I mean, I love Colby Smulders. Tom Cruise, all I can think of is his Scientology thing now. I mean, but it's not getting over my head. I recently watched the Mission Impossible movies. I binged them, watched all four of them, five of them. Yeah, and I was really looking forward to this one, and, but I'm glad I didn't pay the full price to watch it. I was here at the discount theater, and it was playing, and I was looking forward to it, but I'm really disappointed in how it turned out. Um, obviously, Christopher McQuarrie didn't come and direct this, but it's Edward Zwick. It's a real low, low step down from the other ones. And um, like I said, I love Colby Smulders. I love How I Met Your Mother. I love her in The Avengers. I love her in the, in the little indie movies she makes. But this one is just not a, a breakout performance for her. She's trying to do an Emily Blood type of thing, but it's just not vibing. It's not vibing. This whole movie is off pace. It's weird. Um, the first beginning starts out solid. It, get, it starts out very solid, but then it gets very uh, run-of-the-mill, becomes very ordinary and very unentertaining. So I'm going to give it a, a one out of uh, five stars. Sorry, guys. Try better next time. Jack Reacher, never go back. Never should have went back. Should have stopped that one movie.